let me set the scene for you. It's early September, still warm outside. Today was super humid and the mosquitoes are terrible. I may or may not make it out of this woods alive today. And if I don't, you're probably not gonna be seeing this video, but if I do, there's a good chance I survived. You're seeing this video right now. We are heading out to some public land to hang some cameras. I've been wanting to get out on this piece of property for quite some time now, and I've been wanting to hang cameras on it. I know it gets hit a ton during gun season, but I'm looking at bow hunting. Bow hunting in Wisconsin opens here this weekend already. So basically, I'm not looking to get back there this weekend. Obviously, the mosquitoes are terrible. I wanna do some early season scouting here and try to get something patterned for the rut in October. And I'm hoping that wind will kind of drive the mosquitoes away a little bit. This morning, it was very, very still. Uh, we got some rain, so it hatched a lot more of those darn things. And I'll tell you what, they are everywhere. But I'm hoping right now, it's about almost noon and the wind is blowing. So I'm hoping that'll knock some of the mosquitoes down. I can get back there, hang some cameras, and hopefully get some pictures of some big deer. So what my plan is, is I'm gonna go back there, hang some cameras, and then hopefully in a couple weeks, go back there, grab those cameras, stealthy like, um, check them once, uh, see what we got on camera. And if it's worth hunting, I'm gonna try pretty much patterning something back there for the rut this season. So you're gonna see a follow-up video to this about two weeks from now, probably. And then uh, today we're also gonna go back out onto a piece of property that I set some cameras on a couple weeks ago, actually almost a month ago already. Um, that is some property that at least kind of closer to my hometown as well. We're gonna go back there, check that camera today, see what we got going on back there. I'm not gonna bring the big camera out there with me. I'm gonna strap the GoPro to my head. It's gonna be a quick little uh, video here. I'm basically gonna do a little bit of scouting here, see what I can find and hopefully put some cameras in some good spots. Let's go give her a go. few moments later We got some cameras. I got two cameras hung up. Got one more in my backpack, but I think we're just gonna roll with two for now. It is literally suicide back there. I don't know if you guys could see the mosquitoes or hear them when I was setting up that trail camera, but oh my goodness. I found some heavily used deer trails, um, found some intersections, put these cameras on those intersections, and I found a few bedding areas. And uh, that second trail camera that I hung, um, I put a little ways off of that big bedding area that I found back there. Um, there's a lot of wet areas back there, a lot of muck, and I don't really know what to expect. So I guess we'll come back in a couple weeks. Hopefully the mosquitoes won't be so bad. Hopefully uh, it starts to dry up a little bit and uh, it's a little more pleasurable getting back there. So I can handle a few mosquitoes, but whew, when they were as bad as they were, wow, it's, they're not so bad right here because of the wind, but in there, that was absolutely crazy. So onward, we're gonna go check out our trail cameras that we set a few months ago. Actually, like about a month ago, we're gonna go check that trail cam out, see what we got lurking around back in that piece of property. I'm sure the mosquitoes are gonna be just as bad over there. So it's gonna be another in and out mission there, but I would say so far today is a success. We got two trail cameras hung up. That's basically what I wanted to do today. I was hoping to get one more hung up, but I just can't bear this any longer. So I guess we'll check them in a few weeks, see what we got, but let's go check out this other trail camera and see what's lurking around. 12 seconds later. Oh, well, we got everything done that we needed to get done today. We are still alive. Mosquitoes didn't steal too much blood from us. And we got some big bucks on camera. Um, that camera that I set up about a month ago, I don't know if I, I think I posted that video. Uh, that camera that I set up about a month ago now has a ton of deer traffic on it. I uh, got some nice bucks on camera, got a lot of 
other smaller bucks on camera and then we have a lot of those as well so tons and tons of traffic going on back there i had 83 pictures on the camera for the couple weeks that I was hanging up there so awesome to see we're gonna wait and see i'm gonna check that camera again in a couple of weeks um based on where the deer were kind of moving in the frame of the camera it seemed like a lot of them were further away from the camera on that back side so basically what i'm going to do is next time i go out there i'm going to bring another camera with me and i'm going to set it up on that opposite trail that's running basically east and west i'm going to set up a camera on that trail because the deer that are using that east and west trail um, are not intersecting it they're not coming down that trail that's running to the south and i also think i'm going to be moving a stand around so i got my stand basically behind almost right behind the camera that you see now and to the right a little bit. Um, I'm not really liking where that is based on where the deer traffic's coming from. I think I'm gonna end up moving my stand more to the left of the camera and basically to the front left of the camera on the left side, which would be the west side um, and set up, set up on a big tree there that's kind of hidden behind a bunch of leaves i'm looking into getting a tree saddle so if i can get a saddle up in that tree a couple climbing sticks i can get up there a little higher and remain undetected from those deer that are going to be crossing on that trail that that's basically running north to south so got some ideas um like i said deer season opens on saturday there's no way in hell you're going to find me back there this weekend uh, with the amount of mosquitoes that are back there. I don't even think a thermocell would help and I'm really looking forward to get back there and doing some hunting. So we're gonna wait for some colder weather, wait for these bugs uh, basically to go away and then we're gonna start hunting that hard. So thank you guys for watching this video. If you guys are interested in getting some trail cameras for yourself, uh, the pictures that I posted on this video are all taken from Tideweed trail cameras. So you can find a Tideweed trail camera at www.tideweed.com. You can also find a Tideweed trail camera at amazon.com. Other than that, thank you guys again for watching this video. If you guys want to stay tuned to what I'm going to be doing this year and what we're going to be hunting and basically stay up to date with my hunting season, uh, you guys can do that. Just hit that subscribe button down below. Give me a big thumbs up on this video if you enjoyed it. Also, leave some comments down below and let me know what you thought about the pictures. Maybe you got some ideas on what I should do based off the pictures you saw. So leave me some comments down below. Other than that, I'm going to run home, take a shower, and uh, get to editing this video for you guys. So thanks again, guys. I'm Cody from Tideweed. We'll see you on the next video. Peace.